Hey guys, what's up? My name is Namit. I'm an Android developer. So today our topic is to implement Facebook Shimmer effect in Android. So this is the website of Facebook GitHub page, and this is the effect we are just going to implement. And uh, I'll put this link in description. So for now just copy this line this is dependency of shimmer effect and open your android studio open build.gradle of apps module and paste it here then sync now and while it is syncing let me show you the output of the project so guys this is the shimmer effect and it will gonna look really amazing on your real devices and this is the so, so shimmer effect will work like a progress bar or progress dialog you can say as a loader and after you are done with your work like you are loading data from server and when you are done from that then you can show the data so uh, while you are getting the data fetching the data from the server then in the in this time in in this in this 10 seconds or 5 seconds you can show your shimmer effect so it will gonna improve your ui a lot because it looks amazing so for now let me just unsolve this application and now close this and open your activity of fragments java file where you want to implement this shimmer effect so for now just open this xml and as i don't want to waste your time i have already created the, the designs before the video so let me just walk through you and this is our parent layout parent view you can say and in this we have two views one is linear layout and other one is this shimmer effect these two layouts and in this linear layout is our real layout where we will put the data and as I don't want to waste your time so I am not hitting API because this is not for this tutorial is not for showing you the how API works this is for the shimmer effect so I'm using this static fields uh, you you should use recycler view here so I am just using static fields for now let me show you this what we have we have this two fields in the layout and look this is a card view which contains a linear layout horizontal which has this image view imagine it like a profile picture or some video icon and this is username this is user email you can use anything you want depend upon your apps requirement and this is dummy text some dummy text some description you can say and uh, this is our shimmer layout And this is again same layout just instead of those layouts those images those text views we just have this grid layout so it will gonna animate like a shimmer and this will gonna look really awesome so this is again a card view a linear layout a view and a view instead of username instead of email a view instead of that dummy text so that's it so the idea is to show the shimmer effect first just for some seconds and after that show this our show the our real data view which is this one so now if you guys have any issue or you guys want me to clarify it more comment below I'll I'll put some I'll, I'll put my comments or the code in description or like that so no need to worry 
so let's do let's start working in java file open your java file private linear layout activity list items activity list item equal to find view by id r dot id dot this now this is shimmer effect shimmer layout private shimmer frame layout shimmer view so here again also shimmer view find r dot id dot shimmer view container so as i told you i'm not going to hit a api so instead of api i'll use some timer uh, so like a thread so i'll use a handler here if you guys don't know about handler you can it is just like a like a thread like a timer which will gonna do some work after some time like I'm I'm saying I'm I'm using post delay so it will work after this much of seconds like these are this is two seconds so the code which I put in the inside this run method will gonna work after two seconds so fake api call yeah because i am we are really faking the api so for shimmer effect we need to make it visible and let's start the shimmer effect now here copy this code cone because after we are done then we will stop the shimmer animation and then activity list item set visibility visible so guys that's it let's run our application I'm sure it will gonna look awesome so guys here it is our shimmer effect and look it is looking really amazing and you should try on your Android studio and your devices too and if you think this video is worth please like it share it and subscribe it and hit the bell Thank you guys. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.